In the previous video, I already demonstrated how you can use the leaflet package in R for creating a heat map, such as the one displayed here. Usually, when you are working towards a heat map, such as the one um, shown here, you will have a spatial data set to start with that contains location names in the form of strings, and then you will have some kind of observation value. Um, and you now want to investigate the spatial property or spatial distribution of that observation value using a heat map. Um, but in order to create a heat map, you need to translate location names into latitude and longitude scores or coordinates. For this, in my previous video, I implemented the function from scratch using a template from a blog called Data Science Plus. And this function contacted the OpenStreetMap API, sent it the address or location name in, in form of a string, and in return received the latitude and longitude coordinates in JSON format. Now, since then, I received the hint that a new package has been released in R that basically does this geocoding process. So I do not have to write a function from scratch. I can simply use the function which is part of this new package in R. And the package is called OSM data. And I want to show the function get BB, which will be conducting this geocoding process. So I'm implementing here a new example from scratch. We start with a empty data frame that has 20 rows and four columns. I'm assigning some header names to those columns. So the first column will be containing all the location names in form of the string. We will then geocode those location names into latitude and longitude scores. So I'm adding uh, a column called latitude and a column called longitude. Lastly, we will have a column that contains some kind of observation value. Um, so I'm calling this column values. Then I'm creating a list of city or town names um, somewhere in the middle of Germany. And those will now be the location strings that we need to geocode. So in order to conduct the geocoding process, I'm importing OSM data, which is this new package in R. And OSM data contains a function called getBB. This is a function that takes one string or character string and translates it into latitude and longitude scores using the OpenStreetMap API. So in this case, I have 20 city or town names, so I need to loop through my data frame um, and translate every uh, city. Um, well, so I need to translate every city one by one into uh, latitude and longitude scores. This is what I'm doing here in these lines of codes. Now the getBB function will return a matrix that contains information on latitude and, and longitude. But for both latitude and longitude, it will not just return one value. It will instead return both a minimum and maximum value. So it gives some kind of confidence range or something like that. So this is why I need to build an average here. Um, since I have a minimum and a maximum value, I don't simply get one value that I can use. But once I went through these lines of codes and now geocoded all the location names, I wrote them back into the data frame. So I now have populated both column one, two, and three, meaning I have now a data frame with location names and latitude and longitude scores. The last thing I need are some kind of observation values. In this case, I just use some randomly distributed values since this is just a demonstration video. For this, I use a, um, the, uh, a uniform distribution and I create uh, values ranging between 100 and, and 0. So now I really have a complete data frame containing both um, location names, latitude scores, longitude scores, and also some kind of observation values. I can now create my heat map using the leaflet package. So I go ahead here and import some packages that help me with that. Um, and then these lines of codes create the heat map, which I also um, already demonstrated in the previous video. As a result, we can see here um, the spatial in intensity or distribution of this observation value um, for the locations that we geocoded. 